Hi everyone, I am interior designer Christine Cavallas. I was the first Nippon Paint Gold Awardee. Um, I think that was way back 2014. The competition before was called Nippon Paint's Young Designer Award, later changed to Asia's Young Designer Award. So for short, it was NPYDA. Um, because of the competition, I have gained a lot not just the prizes I receive, but also the earnings and realizations. Uh, the design process as a whole or the competition made me open my eyes to the things that I wasn't aware of before, like the problems we are facing right now or the things that are happening around us. Um, it made, it gave me a new perspective of what an interior designer or designer can do to help or solve those problems. Um, it made me realize why Nippon Paint created this kind of competition and why young designers, designers should join and why we should continue to promote sustainable designs. Not like uh, me before when I was still a student I only thought of um, creating or building beautiful spaces where people can live, uh, uh, where people can feel cozy or warm. But it's not just that anymore. It is um, how your design affects or um, impacts everything around you, including nature. So. Uh, those were some of my deep realizations. Um, during the, the Japan trip, um, I have met and workshop with new local and foreign interior designers who are very inspiring. And I have also gained new local and foreign friends who I still communicate with until now. I am so grateful to them because I have learned new traditions and um, design concepts. So being a Nippon Paint winner uh, uh, was uh, helped me through my studies, especially uh, during my thesis. I was so inspired that uh, my thesis was about a sustainable residential house. What I achieved uh, gave me an edge during the time I was looking for a job um, or applying for a job. Um, I was more confident of myself. I already knew what I was capable of, like my weaknesses and my strengths. And um, so... As a whole, the competition overall uh, made uh, molded me to what kind of interior designer I should be. Not just a designer who creates or builds beautiful spaces, but someone who is responsible, has a sustainable thinking, and is environmentally aware. So those were uh, my learnings and realizations so for those who are planning to join um, what I can say is you should take the risk you should always be yourself uh, you should not be afraid to share your talents and you should let the world see what you can offer so, yeah and um, I would really like to thank Nippon Paint for giving me, and not just me, all the young designers, this kind of opportunity for us to showcase our talents and our design skills. And this opportunity um, uh, given to us uh, is a step, or we're so thankful because uh, for us, it is such a great help. Um, we can help the world uh, we can change the world through our design.
through being sustainable and that's why we are so grateful for Nippon for this kind of competition and I would also like to thank the Lord my family and friends my school University of San Carlos Cebu uh, my instructors during that time interior designer Del Monte and interior designer Oplado and especially um, my mentors during the competition, Sir Mike, uh, interior designer Michael Pizarro, and architect Karunungan, and Mom Bernice, and everyone who supported me and who was there for me during the competition. Uh, I'm so grateful for, for you, all of you. So, um, those were uh, some of the learnings and um, the things that uh uh learning is a realization i had uh, because of the competition so um thank you everyone for listening and i hope everyone's staying safe and healthy so god bless and bye